And we're back. Hello. It's Hi. time. It's time for two people to hang out and be BFFs. So, I said I could, like, take you up to the park. You did indeed. I'm so tired. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. You up for this park trip? Nah. Or yeah, yeah. Wow, Vila, you have the car two nights in a row. Yeah. Even after the flat tire. Well, I mean, you can't really do anything about that. And I replaced the tire. Oh, yeah. Cool, you could borrow her car, though. I had to ride on Greg's bike. When we saw that ghost. Yeah, Greg needs to get his license. I fell off his bike. <laughs> Which I also did a few days before that. So you think the guy you saw was a ghost? Not a guy, a ghost. Right. Why does no one believe me that it was a ghost? Well, I mean, ghosts don't actually exist. I actually was about to say, well, I mean. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they do. Well, I'd need evidence. What counts? A ghost walking up and saying hello. And me saying, hey, I've been verified you are a dead person. Could be a zombie or a Frankenstein. You got Twitter decay. <laughs> okay, maybe if they're made of ghosty stuff. Ghosty stuff can be our podcast. About ghosts. This episode of Ghosty Stuff brought to you by Donut Wolf. No, I'm going to be sick. Sorry. Welcome to Ghosty Stuff. I'm May and I saw ghosts and this is Angus. Who doesn't believe me? I'm Angus and this is May. She's a crazy person. <laughs> a great podcast. Angus and the crazy person saw like, like a sitcom in Nine of the Woods. <laughs> <laughs> nice evening. Yeah, it's all right. My mom used to take me us up here to play frisbee. I got hit in the teeth with a frisbee once, full speed. Jeez. Casey and me were throwing things at each other's heads. Oh. We stopped after the frisbee. Toasted. Do not feed. Or touch. The wildlife. Well, that seems extreme. Well, clearly. That seems a bit strange. Extreme. I don't know. You can't go into the woods like socialize with the woods I guess there's some folks living in cabins up here you can uh, feed and touch them if you want <laughs> it's a weird old place up here there's all kind of weird stuff back up in the park old stuff just hanging out in the woods We'll hit my old scout camp on the way up, I think. Busy woods. Okay. Better get going before it gets dark. Wait, you scared of geese? Alright, that's right. You don't believe in them! No, I'm scared of being in the dark in the forest with you. I wouldn't do anything, I promise. Are you scared of mm. holding May's hand in these deep dark woods with ghosts in them? I'm scared of being liable for a person's life. I mean, I feel that. 
<laughs> I am very happy that they have an actual walking speed version that you can keep up with. Great. That, that, that needs to be added in more games. <sighs> you alright? Yeah, I got asthma is all. Sorry you got away from me. Do you have an inhaler, or...? Didn't you run cross-country back in high, junior high? Uh, do you have an inhaler? Uh, cross-country. Matt, what do you want? Uh... Inhaler or cross-country? I don't know, cross-country. Yeah, but I never finished a race. Why'd you keep doing it? I have no idea. What is this thing? This is like... A lime kiln, I think? Limes? Kill? Limes? Limes? Limestone. You like, do something with it in, here, in there. And it becomes this other thing. Oh. Limestone's weird because it's mostly made out of skeletons of sea creatures from millions of years ago. So, like, this was all underwater or something at one point. This made me think of a post I saw where it uh, showed a crab, uh, like a like a sea crab, like from ancient times, mm -hmm. had moved. Six inches to give them a dick pic. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I were a sea crab, I would 100% move to give people a dick pic. Mm. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, well, we're not I actually see... here. We are here, but we're not here. I see, I see. I hear. All right, so you just wanted to listen in on the episode. I get you. Ba yeah. Basically. <laughs> I figure it will be like a radio show. I do apologize in advance when our GPS comes in with a dog voice. Amazing. Woof. Woof, woof. You, you'll, you'll hear it at some point, and then the internet can tease us about it. Go for it, internet. <laughs> right, that, re that reminded me of uh, when we were driving around in Poland, and my uncle had his GPS out, and it it talked like he uh, it was old carriage driver like a horse-drawn carriage driver. And I'm like, oh. uh, like talking to you as if you were the horse. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, it was it was funny. The first Whoa. time we heard it speak, we're like, what? Whoa, <laughs> whoa take the next right. No, I'm like you're saying line. Whoa. Yeah, it's either whoa or no way. No way. Whoa. No way. I say whoa. All right, got one vote for woe, one vote for no way. Matt, what's your vote? I'm going with woe. All right. Yay. I know, right? Like, I vote right for no way because Sam voted for woe. I wasn't counting your late. vote, DJ, because you have no <laughs> idea what the, the conversation was about at that point. Correct. Like, right where we're standing. There were, like, ancient, horrible sea monsters. Creepy and awesome. That's history. Okay, I'm ready to go. Teleports up the hill. Oh. Oh. Need to take a break? I'm okay. I'm okay. No problem. Oh. So if this place was underwater, where'd the water go? Why aren't there like ancient sharks bones up here? Aren't the Asian shark bones up here? I know why, but May does not. Hmm. Where'd the water go? Matt, what's your vote? Matt, 
Matt? Okay. <laughs> DJ Hannah, what's your vote? Um, what are our options? Why aren't there like ancient shark moans up here or where'd the water go? Where'd the water go? Sure. Okay. Where'd the water go? Excuse me. Uh, there you are. What? I don't Except know. Alright. I don't know. To the ocean, I guess? And like, Earth is always shifting. So mountains get all pushed up. Where they used to be just flat ground. Weird because things are so boring nowadays. To think all that crazy stuff was going on here. There's always more weird stuff that happened. To find out about later. Okay, I'm ready to go. Cool, cool. <gasps> Hello, Bob. Oh, Bob. Oh, Bob. Breathing. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Seriously, it's fine. Hang for a minute. Okay. I should know all of this stuff about, like, ancient sea creatures, rock, or whatever. Lime. Stone. Wow. I was gonna take a class of dinosaurs back at school. What happened? It was all full up. The class fills up fast. I bet. I love dinosaurs, or... Dinosaurs are like the most interesting animals. Hmm. Uh, dinosaurs the most interesting animals. Okay. Oh, I love dinosaurs! And I heard Let's Seb see. also say that, even though DJ mm -hmm. tried to drown out Seb's answer. Yeah. How could you? I wasn't trying to drown out, I just really love dinosaurs. I, I teach six-year-olds. It's part of the job. All right, uh, Hannah, uh, what, what's your answer? I, I love dinosaurs, or dinosaurs are like the most interesting animals? All right, so that's three votes for I love dinosaurs. Okay. Who doesn't? Things were so scary and cool back then. We die in like five minutes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ancient creatures would eat us. No problem. Be glad for the millions of years between us. Weird. Time, dude. Time makes most dangerous things less dangerous. Most things, at least. Okay, you ready to roll? Yeah, we're almost at the top. I can't get, I'm glad I'm here for this. Wow. Wow. My old scout camp. You just come up here with my troop. Like a decade ago. You're the agency monster now. Looks like it. Wow. Looks like some of the wirely. Yeah. Whirly. Yeah. Looks like some of the whirly note things came back. The what? Um, we made these little windmill things. And each put an anonymous note in them. Attached to this little spring-controlled helicopter. And the idea was that when the wind would pick them up, the windmill would wind up the helicopter. 
and the note would fly away. Looks like some of them blew back. That's an amazing coincidence. Oh no, that was the idea. Each year we'd read notes left from the year before. I'm going to see if I can find any more. I'm going to hike up here. been a while. So, you guys remember each of those little windmill things that I've been chomping at. Doing... Ah. Uh, yeah, these are the notes. Hey, they're they're finally here. Thick. Yay! Yeah, I was trying... Like communicate with that with you, DJ. <laughs> I was just being nostalgic for those like windmill toys that he used to play with as a kid. Mm hmm. You know, like the, the like the Barbie ones and the like Transformer ones, and like you just wind them up and be like, Woo! Mm hmm. <laughs> that one. No, it's like, yeah, if you remember on the rooftops. Yeah, yeah, I know I do. I love it. That's so cute. That one. That one. That one. This is really amusing to hear only the audio of. That one. <laughs> that one. <laughs> that, one. Got one. Got one. <laughs> that one. That one. That one. I think you got them all. From what I can spot, at least. And I got the high vantage point. Let's read them. Let's read them. Wait, should we though? We gotta leave them for the scouts. No, oh, it's fine. Any ones up here wouldn't last the winter anyway. Okay, okay, okay. Let's read one. Okay, here's one. Hi, I'm not supposed to write my name. And that's fine. Because I'm a scout. And that is the only name I need. Wow, that's intense. It goes on. The scouts gave me an, more than a name. They gave me badges to show my worth. <laughs> Jeez. I would kill for the scouts. I'm so glad that our two scouts aren't here to have an hour-long <laughs> diatribe about how this is true. The, uh, there's no one to bounce off of here. <laughs> oh, were you also scouts, Sam? Yes. Uh, I was a scout. I, I don't remember you contributing as much to the scout conversation as Andrew and Harry were. Pro probably because I, I'm, was uh, I was part of the Polish scouts, which was mm. a section away from BSA. Uh, okay. I, I remember they had like a. I, I, I was actually in Girl Scouts a little bit, although yeah. Girl Scouts is very different. It is very different. Mm -hmm. I was just in the. We Girl had a Scouts whole episode I, of Pikmin, I think, that was just a big old discussion about Scouts. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, and Pikmin. Yep. <laughs> we had two. Mm hmm. <laughs> anyway. I remember that. Uh, that's it. Were you all like this? Kinda. Sometimes. No. Maybe. Okay, let's read this here. Read it! <laughs> oh dear. What? I am super, super gay. Haha, <laughs> nice. Angus, did you write this one? Jeez, I could have. I think my note was about being strong and good. And gay SL, apparently. I think my total gain is kind of came through to the discerning reader. Alright, let's read this note. Ahem. I like shooting arrows. They are cool to shoot. In fact, I think we should shoot arrows instead of guns when we're in the army it has a tactical advantage in that it is silent and also elegant huh. also reusable yeah I got nothing alright this one got kind of torn up 
Maybe a bird got it. Read the bird note. I'm extremely unhappy, and you're the only person who knows. Oh. Okay. Hmm. What? Not much changes. Could have just as easily been our notes from ten years ago. Yeah. There's like a... Timelessness. About people. Some things just don't stop being what we are. Huh. Yeah. Hmm. Wait, there was four notes. Why didn't they read the last one? I think they read four. Yeah, they read four. Oh, okay. I guess I only count three mentally. Well, that was a hike. That was a lot easier when I was 11. We passed, what, three gates on the way up here? I lost count. Weird. Used to be open back then. Hmm. Ready to go? Not far now, just up ahead. Graves, huh? Yeah, these were... Yeah, I forget. They were involved in po the Possum's Massacre. That, like, labor strike thing. Where it was all, like, miners versus National Guard. Happened back in town, like, a hundred years ago. Why are they up here? I think these were some of the bad guys. Some of the miners... Didn't want them bur buried in town. Oh, huh. There's like a few old graveyards up here from like... Colonial times. Guess there's one up here somewhere too. Well. That's spooky. Eh, just bones. Ancient shark bones! Yeah, see? Nothing left to be scary. Here we are. This is one of my favorite scenes in this entire game. Wow, we're really up high. And really far up. I can't see town from here. It's south of us, behind whatever ridge that is. So what, are we just supposed to wait here and see if anything happens? You tell me. You're the expert. I guess we'll just wait here and see if anything happens. Nice night. Yeah. Back at school, I couldn't see as many stars. That always made me sad. Oh, yeah. They're really nice up here. I wish I knew the constellations like you did. What? You know, all the names and the stories and stuff? I wish. I can never remember them other than... I think that one up there is like a bell or something? No, 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 no. Remember that time we were all at the Longest Night Bonfire? And we spotted the constellations together? And you told us all about them? Sorry, I was watching a video. <laughs> I need to do something funny. I would recommend you focus on this, Sam. This is one oh, of the best Oh, no, that's why I stopped. That's not a thing that happened. Oh, wow. Maybe it was like a dream or something. Yeah, actually, funny this. enough, that's a reference to uh, Longest Night, the little small mini game that we could play. Oh. And remember, mm. that is what happened. Angus was telling everyone about the constellations, and he was even like, a, all the characters were slightly out, out of character. 
because he was like, mm-hmm. "All right, listen up, dummies. Let me learn you something good." <laughs> God, I barely remember now. You and me both, may. Wonder what fake constellations and stories you dreamed up. Okay, humor me. I'll find the constellations. You tell me about them. Okay then. All right, find me some constellations. Wait, are these going to be real ones or fake ones? Just ones I remember. Or dreamed that one time. Ugh. Whichever. Remember Mr. Chesakov? Just go. Cool. Yeah, science teacher. He lives in Underhill and has a telescope on his roof. And I totally saw some stars through it. That's cool. Telescopes are cool. I wish I had we a saw telescope. The, the show, we saw the stars with Chazikov. 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 The guy whose accent changes every time we see him. Okay, let's see. mental image are you looking for stars right now yeah i'm struggling with them though fair first we were like wait well, it's a whale and it's got like the world on its back oh wow that's sad yeah or why 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 all right i'll go with why why does it have to carry Why? the whole world? Like, that's really unfair. Ah, uh, yeah. That is legitimately upsetting. You gotta wonder why people made these up. I mean, like, these specifically. Who saw a whale and was like, needs to be scaring something? I mean, I feel that way every time. Time. What was that? Every time people talk about constellations, I'm like, who? Why? When? Okay. That's how mm-hmm. I got into myths and stuff was because of constellations. Ah. Sick. Uh, I mean, wells are pretty big, or uh, they didn't know what the earth was. I mean, wells, wells are, are pretty, pretty big. big. Uh, wells are pretty big. Okay. There's a consensus. Well, what's the whale swimming in? Hey! I guess it's dumb to get mad at ancient people. Beautiful. Oh, this is gonna be the Pope. Yep. Nice. It's a Pope! To the Pope star? He breathes fire. <laughs> oh, this one is real. Or at least the dude is. Rubello. Rubello, but yeah. Bello. Oh. I need There's a statue of him outside church. Oh, we never went there. Did your family go to church? Do you not know your saints at all? Did your family go to church? Uh, oh, there's there are choices? Did your family go to church? Yeah, I was curious. Okay. Did you not know your saints at all? Sounds a little judgy. Weddings and funerals and longest night, basically. 
I don't think those first two count. Those are like events. My mom works at the church now. I haven't gone really since I was like 14 or 15. Does she mind? She pretends not to. I like that answer. She pretends. To do. Wait, she, did I hear that right? She pretends not to? Yeah. Yep. That's a beautiful answer. And it's beautiful that Maze says that too. It's a gap. What the fuck? Gotta, that's Randall. I'm pretty that's... sure that's Randall. Uh, and he's chasing a diamond. Oh, I know this one. Don't remember his name. He lived, uh... You remember the stories about the forest god? Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah? Okay, I'll go yeah. My granddad used to tell me Adina stories. Oh, okay, yeah. Anyway, this cat was in there. Liked shiny things, was good at getting through the forest. Was really good at stealing. Oh, well, yeah, I used to call him Ass Cat when I was little. Well, then he stole Diamond from a king and got arrowed to death. But he was slick enough that he jumped out of his body and became immortal or something. Huh, decent. Extremely decent. Okay, that's the bell. And in the middle of the, the this middle is this eye. Looking at you. Okay, that's uh I know this one. A uh, little from up I know this one a little from like prog rock album covers. I think the world ends when it rains. I think you die when it rains when it's looking at you. I think the world ends when it rains. Looking at you. DJ Hannah? Yes. <laughs> Which choice sounds better? Oh, you're cutting out, so... Robot. Matt, what's your preference? Hmm... What are, the, what are the choices? Uh, I think the world ends when it rings, or I think you die when it rings when it's looking at you. <clears throat> hmm. I think the world ends. Okay, then. That makes sense. It's gonna be really loud. There's no sound in space. I mean, yeah. like, basically no sound, usually. That sounds really scary for some- that sounds really scary for some reason. Well, at least it means we're not gonna get rung to death by a bell. Your zone, I should think. That's fair. You're the most common to your zone, I should think. We're like way out like here, here, huh? In the park? Yeah, I guess. Spooky. I don't know. It's pretty safe. And the stars are pretty. So you don't believe in ghosts at all? Nah. Don't believe in ghosts. Or gods. Or psychic powers. Or anything like that. Not at all? I mean, there's no evidence for them. And people have really tried. Did you ever? Yeah, when I was a kid. Tell me about it. So, um... I don't know how much I've ever told you. 
or how much Greg has told you. But I didn't have the best childhood. Yeah, I think I heard that. Why was it bad? Um, my dad didn't like me. My mom didn't either. And like, um... You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. No, it's fine. Um, my dad used to hit me a lot. And my mom was probably worse. She, like, wouldn't feed me. Which is why I really like cooking now. <laughs> she, like, shoved me into the pantry. And slammed the door really hard. And all this stuff would fall out off the shelves and on top of me. I'm mad. Oh my god, Angus. This I is so I, I would recommend staying silent until oh it's done, God. DJ. Oh. That's awful. She'd lock me in there for like a day at some time. Or overnight. So I'd like try to develop psychic powers. So I could like signal the neighbors. Or unlatch the door. Didn't work, as you might guess. Did you ever tell anybody? Never did. Yeah. Don't know why. After a while, I was like... Started feeling guilty, too, for some reason. Like this was something bad I was doing. Like being abused? Angus, that's not your fault at all. You were a kid. Oh, don't worry. I know that now. Boy, do I ever. Question. Can I go kick all their uh, all their asses? Like, I've got experience. I can F some shit up. Well, my mom's kind of old now. I uh, still have to visit her sometimes. I have a brother. He's overseas in the army. And my dad left like 10 years ago. But who knows where he is or if he's even alive. If he is alive, I don't want to know about it. Oh, um, Angus, I just want to give you a hug forever. <laughs> well... I was luckier than a lot of kids. I'm just glad I didn't, like... Yeah. Anyway, to your original question. Testing out my psychic abilities in the pantry. Made me really interested in both paranormal stuff and science. And to join the Skeptic Society on the internet. And that kind of ruined me on a lot of other supernatural bullshit. And it gave me something to solve. Something you could debunk or know. I don't know. It saved me a little, I guess. Because when someone does all that stuff to you, it can make you, like, do some bad things to yourself. But anyway, yeah. No. No ghosts or God. So, like, I feel like if I've been through that, I'd be more likely to want to believe in God or something. Do you believe in anything at all? Um, well, so like the constellations. I don't believe there's a whale out there. But I believe that the stars exist. And that people put the whale there. Like, I don't know. We're good at drawing lines through the spaces between stars. Like, we're pattern finders and we'll find patterns. And we, like, really put our hearts and minds into it. And even if we don't mean to. So I believe in a universe that doesn't care. 
and people who do. Pattern finders. I feel like a lot of people don't think they found God. But like God found them. Like when they were having bad times like you did. God never did. I was completely alone in the pantry. But a few years later, Greg did. So like, stars can stay up there and not give a shit about us. The, but this whale is pretty cool. You are an extremely good and smart person, Angus. I try. But I'm no more than anyone else. Yep. Yep. I should come out here more often. <laughs> yeah. Don't look at him. <gasps> oh, I just noticed. That scared the living shit out of me. Yeah. I like how I noticed it before and before Sam and I did mention it. <laughs> and so don't look at him. And I was like, why are we not all panic? I was like, why are we looking at them? Yep, on the far right of the screen is our new friend. Funny friend. Who? There's someone standing behind us. In the trees. Holy shit. Holy shit. What did they look like? Tom wearing some kind of weird coat. Like a utility coat or something. Oh god. That's the ghost. I'm more worried about it being a living person. Standing in the woods, staring at us. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Well... No, no, you got it. Oh, yeah. Don't panic. Follow my lead. Hey there! Out for a hike? Nice night. He's not answering. That's a little hostile, right? That's definitely a little hostile. Hey! I know what you did! Mate, no. I saw you! <clears throat> okay, well, we're gonna run now. We need to get the car. But your asthma! I got an inhaler. The good kind, too. <laughs> the good shit. No it's one in heaven or can stop me! Okay, okay, let's go! Deep breaths. In. Out. All right. Rah! Oh, there's Andrew. Hello. Andrew, we can't hear you. I'm not talking yet. Oh, oh well, your thing was lighting up, so that's... Oh, ah, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, he was going to come after you guys. <laughs> he was too quick. It zooms. He fucking it zoomed. zoomed. <sighs> you okay, big guy? Yeah, I'll be okay in a few minutes. I'm resilient. So that was it. That was the ghost. Or it was some... <gasps> Some weirdo who lives out there. They probably get a lots of kids throwing parties back there. I mean, the party we went to went through where you threw up. Uh, I wasn't too far from there. Why does nope? Oh, look. Ah! Hey. Ah! 
What's wrong? Do you need to pull over? Oh, my head, jeez. Oh. Okay, well, let's get you home. No! Need to talk to everyone tonight. What? All of us. I need all of us. Thanks for, like, coming. All right. Well, I think we should actually stop here until Han and DJ actually get home, because B's in the scene. Yeah. Fun fact, we are home, but we need to swap over to our computer. Ah. Okay. All right, well, um, still, I think this is a good place to end this episode, so say goodbye, mm -hmm. everyone. Ah, goodbye. Hi. I'm glad I was here to hear that, because it's such a beautiful moment where he's like, you know... The world sucks, uh -huh. mm -hmm. but like... DJ, you didn't give me it, enough time to it. actually end the episode. Okay. Say goodbye! Bye! Bye! Bye. 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 Bye.